This is our list of the top 20 items we felt were essential uh, for having a baby. They are based on research from YouTube videos, blogs, and other websites. Each product we felt we can back up with good decisions. First is the rocker. We tested every rocker out at Babies or Us, and this is the most comfortable one. It has a high back, so my husband is able to lean his head back. It's also very wide and comfy, and you're going to be sitting in it a lot, so I suggest you test them out. This is the travel system. The travel system is a Chico. Um, it had the highest ratings. It was really a good quality stroller and car seat. There's no question that this was the one for us. The breast pump, I hope to breastfeed, but if I'm not able to, or I am able to, I wanted to make sure I had something that wouldn't hurt and something that has gotten really great reviews. The nursery center we picked mostly because we do plan on taking the baby with us to visit relatives on occasion, and since relatives won't have anything for us to place the baby in, this, um, would be easy to take with us. It also matches with the travel system we had picked out. The baby monitor. If you uh, YouTube um, type in Next Step IP system, you'll see an example of how this baby monitor works. It links to your iPhone and also your laptop, and it really is a great monitor. The swing I heard was the best thing to have with a newborn. It'll soothe them. This one had all the key components we wanted, the music, the vibration, the speed levels. Um, if you compare it at Babies or Us to other ones, it really had all of the things you need in the swing. The feeding chair we added last minute. Eventually he'll need a feeding chair, but this one matches the travel system and the playpen that we had picked for Chico. The baby Bressa, I YouTubed it, I saw examples, compared it to the Baby Bullet, and there's another brand also. This is a one-step uh, baby proce food processor, and really it does everything in one step, which I thought simplifies everything. The crib we negotiated and actually ended up with a lesser expensive crib, and the bedding set. Uh, we're still negotiating on whether or not to put the bumper, but we went mostly on cuteness and definitely quality on the crib. The bouncer is also another um, essential item I found that you will need. Um, I'm not sure how it will compare to the swing, but every mother out there um, said you need to have a bouncer. So we picked this one because it had vibration. The floor place that they need for tummy time, and this was, I thought, the cutest one. Uh, the little mobile on top has mirror, music, lights, and it just seemed to have all of the essential um, key things that attract baby. The boppy pillow. This is actually a generic one at um, Walmart, but what I liked about it is you can see it has a little strap for the baby, and the regular boppy pillows that you see at Baby Star Us and other stores don't, so I really wanted to test it out. A baby cleaning supplies. Um, obviously, I, I'm not going to be hand washing everything. I like the convenience of a dishwasher, so these items are necessary for keeping baby's items clean. Uh, the baby bottles, the Dr. Browns had the best ratings out there. There's the glass and the BPA-free uh, plastic bottles. Uh, they have a lot of little parts, but I heard they really help with colic and they're the best. Grooming supplies, the baby will need to have a first aid kit, obviously, and creams and lotions, and this is kind of two kits that I found that I felt were a great starter for any new mom. The diaper genie. There are going to be tons of diapers and mostly my concern is on uh, night diapers, putting somewhere to place them. We also have three dogs and they have a habit of trash digging, so having something that's safe and doggy proof is essential. The bathtub. Um, the bathtub, uh, the whale one, had the best reviews. It's adorable. Just um, just for newborns mostly or little ones. Eventually they grow out. We need pacifiers, uh, pacifier clips, teething rings, um, all of these I picked mostly based on cuteness but the Gondrup did have the best reviews on YouTube and the Wubanub was just adorable. Had to buy one. Crib accessories. Uh, we need to have waterproof crib mattresses. There's bound to be accidents so I think a waterproof crib cover is essential extra um, linens for the baby for when he has accidents I think is essential. 
a baby changing station for my diaper bag. I need something that I can take with me when I go shopping, when I go out, so I can change them. There's going to be places that don't always offer a changing uh, station, so I need to have one with me at all times. Other miscellaneous items I didn't add are baby clothes, baby socks, baby towels, baby cloths, baby blankets, baby bibs, baby books, toys, nursing cover, nursing bra, nursing pads, shopping cart cover, diapers, and baby wipes, and tons of cute other stuff. Overall, just the cost of these 20 items that I have listed, uh, this is their price, uh, the California state tax, the quantity that I felt I would need of each, um, and the, the summary overall just for getting pretty much one or two of each item is going to total up to a significant amount as you can see so the total that is expected to be uh, spent on these newborn items is two thousand nine hundred twenty eight dollars and sixty five cents so you can see having a baby is a high cost but hopefully you have a great baby shower and other people get you all these wonderful things i hope it helps thank you